Good morning, everybody. I hope you're all doing well. I have literally just got out of bed. I haven't even made the bed. Um, and I sat down straight away because I put the camera up last night because I knew if I'm not going to do it, I'm probably not going to film. Because it is hair wash day and I need to do something about this crazy mane. And quite a few of you have been asking, what is my hair care routine? So I'm going to show you. Um, a little bit what my kind of weekly wash looks like. I wash my hair once a week. Um, that is due to the reasons that I, A, I'm lazy and B, I don't like washing my hair too much. So as you can see, this is a week off not washing my hair. I used dry shampoo once yesterday. I will show you the dry shampoo that I like to use, but it's not looking too bad. I mean, it's pretty greasy at the top. So what I tend to do, I tend to clip my hair back like that, maybe with a bit of dry shampoo. Uh, but we are gonna start with a treatment. This is a treatment that I do once every two weeks. So if I wash my hair once a week, I do this every two weeks. Um, and I love it because it just keeps my hair very hydrated. Uh, as you can see, I have a balayage on my hair, so there's a little bit of bleaching going on. So I need to kind of give it a little bit of loving because otherwise it can get really dry on the ends. So I'm going to start by um, wetting my hair so it's just towel dry. And then I'm going to work this elasticizer from Philip Kingsley through my hair. This is pretty much a magic product. I've been using it for probably a good five years now, and even my hairdresser swears by it. Like through the length of my hair, work it into my hair with my fingers, and then you can leave it up to like four or five hours. And at the same time as the length of my hair is getting nourished by the elasticizer, I also like to do a little scalp mask. I either use the Briogeo one or the Amorovisa one. So this is called Revitalizing Scalp Mask. It's a really nice applicator and you get this like charcoal looking mask. But I like the applicator because you can really work through the roots. So I'm going to apply it just on the scalp and then I'll just rub it in with my fingers. And then I just twist my hair like that. And I've got this really nice towel scrunchies from Kitsch. So I'm going to use that because it just keeps the water away. Look like this. <laughs> Proper little towels. And then just pop that on. And that will keep the hair from dripping all over the place. And so as that is doing its thing, I can just get on some chores down and things like this. So that's what I normally do. And I'm gonna keep it for a couple of hours. I'm actually gonna do my nails um, because why not? They need doing. And again, I'll show you actually a couple of products that I have been absolutely loving. Life-changing really when it comes to doing your own nails at home. This is the product. This is my little lamp that I'm going to be using. The amazing thing about it is when you store it, it literally folds away. And the other amazing thing about this is that you can take this nail polish off with a normal nail polish remover. So I use their brand. These are all the colors that I have. Um, I haven't really made my mind up yet which one I'm going to use. So I've got a top coat and a base coat that I need to apply. But I am tempted by the yellow because I'm going on a holiday and I feel like it's very appropriate. And they also have these amazing things. So when you take it off, you put a little cotton pad soaked in um, the solution on your nail. You clip it on and it literally comes off, peels off in about five seconds. Um, absolutely genius. Um, so this is called Manucurist. This is the brand. Um, and I've literally been using for the last year and a half and I haven't had any nail salon appointments, not once. Well, I've just done my last top coat, so I'm just treating my second hand and I really like it. I think it's super cute um, and this is going to stay on for a couple of weeks because this acts like a gel polish 
and then you can just remove it with a normal nail polish. Um, and the nail polishes are all actually made with sugar cane and cotton and corn, so a much better kind of ingredient list on those. So yeah, really loving it. Super easy to do at home. So I'll just give them a good little cure and that's done. So I've painted my nails, which is very exciting. I absolutely love them. So I've painted my nails, which I'm really, really happy with. And it's just a really good way to use the time. So um, it's been a couple of hours now. I've done some more jobs around the house. I've made the bed. I did washing. So it's been about an hour and a half, hour 40. So I'm going to have to wash it off just because I need to get on with my day. Um, the uh, shampoo and the conditioner that I use are living proof. So the shampoo is the frizz one and the living proof conditioner and the, and the conditioner is the restore. These are really good if you have dryish, uh, bleached, colored, frizzy hair. Like mine goes a bit mad when I wash it and just air dry it. Um, so these are really, really good. So this is what I'm going to use. I'm going to rinse it with water first just to get the elasticizer out. And then I'm going to use the shampoo and conditioner. And then we will dry it. So the hair has been washed, the hair has been towel dried and I am ready to get it to even dry a condition and I'm actually really excited to show you the device that I have been using to dry my hair because I think it is the most beautiful, most tactile, the most handsome hair dryer I've ever seen and it is the Zuvi Halo. I mean let's just take a moment to appreciate how it looks. And then I can blow your mind with some of the incredible new technology that this has. So this has an incredible thing that is called light care, which means this um, mimics the rays of sun and the rays of light when you leave your hair to not dry naturally. So it dries and evaporates the hair from uh, the water from the surface of your hair. It doesn't damage the cuticle. It doesn't damage the inside of your hair. Um, it's also a much lower temperature than most hair dryers. So it's a about 40 44 degrees Celsius which normally they're about 60 um, which means you are drying your hair out so it has four different settings care fast soft style so you can choose what you want it also comes with a couple of attachments uh, I haven't used the attachments yet to be fair so it has the diffuser I very rarely use a diffuser uh, but I when I want that kind of a bit of a wavy beachy bouncy look it's a great one to like bounce your hair with and then we've got this one which is great for styling but because you guys know I'm a lazy lazy person it's all about just drying my hair and maybe there will be some styling at the end or maybe I just leave it style itself because it doesn't do a bad job of styling itself there's kind of like a natural curl going on so I know that everybody's aware of heat damage when it comes to hair and that's why I've been loving this because this doesn't damage your whole hair shaft it basically contains the moisture inside of your hair uh, keeping it like shinier healthier smoother um, especially if you dye your hair I would definitely recommend having a look at this little guy and also let me just show you how cute and how beautiful it looks when the light comes on <laughs> amazing right you will see how quickly this dries my hair and I have a lot of hair which I do like because that just means using less energy just a little bit of a lessened impact so let's get drying <laughs> So it has been uh, less than five minutes, probably three minutes that I've been drying my hair. And if I could take your hands and put them into my hair, you would know how much hair I have. So this is uh, so quick considering how much hair I have. And another thing I love about this is that I don't need to use any like heat protection because it just doesn't damage your hair. And also, one thing I'm sure people will relate to and understand and appreciate is I don't sweat. Like I'm literally, I'm not sweating while I'm doing this, which I hate. I have to like undress when I'm drying my hair, but I am like fine. I'm fine. There are no beads of sweat on my face. So I'm going to uh, dry it a bit more, 
give it a quick brush and then I actually might use the diffuser. Um, I think today's the day, why not? So my hair is pretty much dry, so I'm gonna pop the um, diffuser on. <laughs> Amazing. Okay, volume. We are there. Okay, I am going to leave my hair as it is for now. And I'm going to finish it drying once I've done my makeup because uh, that is the beauty of this hair dryer that you can actually use it when the makeup is already on because it doesn't like heat up your face. So let's do it. So I've just finished my makeup and I've just put a little bit of lip balm on. And I mean, I'm quite low maintenance when it comes to makeup. Also, I am loving the sun hitting my face. I mean, I'm like, ah. Uh... So I'm gonna get my hair out and I mean, just look at the volume. I'm a fan, I'm a big fan. So I'm gonna give it a quick blast over uh, to finish it off and then I'll put a little bit of oil into my hair just to tame it and that's it. The only thing I always have to check that my fringe know where to go. I'm definitely the person who kind of thinks the messier the better, so don't uh, expect any kind of sleek hairstyles from me. Um, I'm just going to use a drop of oil just to get the very frizzy bits out, but to be fair, this is exactly how I like my hair. So just going to put a little bit through and that is my hair care routine done. So this is kind of what I do. This is what happens when it comes to hair. Absolutely loving it. Also, um, I mean, just a big shout out to this. I'm just enjoying it so much at the moment. Uh, I will leave the link below check it out, all the information will be there. If you have any questions at all about anything that I mentioned, anything that I showed today, do not hesitate to drop it into the comment section. Don't hesitate to message me on Instagram or wherever. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. Thank you so much for hanging out with me and I hope to see you soon very, very, and I hope to see, and I hope to see you very, very soon in my next video. Bye.